The new Mojo programming language has Python-like syntax, allows you to leverage the entire Python ecosystem, and is 35,000 times faster. Is this real life? Before we dive into the specifics, let's look at the team behind the project. Mojo was developed by a company called Modular, whose goal is to simplify AI development and AI infrastructure so teams can develop, deploy, and innovate faster. The company was founded by Chris Latner and Tim Davis. Chris Latner has major programming street cred as he's the founder of LLVM, Clang, MLIR, and probably a bunch of other abbreviations. Tim Davis built, founded, and scaled large parts of Google's AI infrastructure and led product management there. The team has already raised $30 million from venture capitalists. So yeah, they're legit. So what's the motivation behind Mojo? Well, it's because Python's got more issues than a gossip magazine. Just kidding, Python's great, but there are some problems with it. Namely, it doesn't have great low-level performance, and CPython, the default Python interpreter, has something called a global interpreter lock, which basically means threading is really slow. Python also isn't suitable for systems programming. For fast performance, many Python libraries are actually implemented in C or C++ like NumPy, TensorFlow, and PyTorch, which are all heavily used in machine learning. This makes debugging difficult, as developers have to know two languages, and some debuggers can't even step through both languages. So the idea behind Mojo is to unify all development into one language, still supporting Python syntax for easy development, yet having the performance of C with fast threading. Sounds great, right? Eager to start using it? Well, too bad because you have to sign up for access and pray to the gods that Modular gives you access. But they have documentation on their site already, and it looks pretty good so far. The coolest feature, by the way, file name extensions can be a fire emoji. They've also added some nice extensions to Python for systems programming. One is let and var declarations. This is similar to JavaScript's let and const, although let in Mojo means the value is immutable and var means the value is mutable. They also added struct types, which are static and bound at compile time, meaning they cannot be monkey patched or modified during runtime. This means they're faster, and as a developer, you can decide when to use a class or a struct. Another nifty feature is strong type checking, which checks that variables are the correct type at runtime. Just so many performance gains here. There are many other features listed in the documentation. Give it a read if you're interested. Link is in the description. I've already signed up for access and will give it a try once I gain access and report back. So make sure to subscribe so you don't miss out on future updates.